I just spent a few days in Amsterdam, the first stop in my European trip, and I already had some nice catches. Although I wanted to try to catch some of those Dutch shortwave stations, there's quite a few of them, I didn't actually manage with that. But then on medium wave, I had some very interesting catches. I also found a very interesting little shop in the center of Amsterdam selling beautiful old radios. It's this one. You cannot even see that it's a radio shop. There's no name, but when you look through the window, you see all these beautiful old radios. Unfortunately, they were closed on the day that I was there. And then I left the next day, so I couldn't actually go inside. But that's the street if you would like to go and see it. So the catches I made, the first one was Radio Europe. It's also known as Radio Young Europe, Radio Young Europa, sometimes. And this station broadcasts from a 100-watt transmitter only in a very small place called Alphen an den Rhein, which is sort of to the southeast of Amsterdam. It's a nice catch. It's one that I think you can only make if you are somewhere close to the Netherlands, probably, because that power is really quite low. And then the other one was also on medium wave, 918 kilohertz. This one is quite historic, I think. This is Radio Monique. It's a radio station that broadcast in the 80s from a ship in the North Sea, this one. And then they stopped broadcasting, but then they returned to the airwaves in 2020. Again, broadcasting from an unknown location using a 100-watt transmitter only. So, also a very difficult catch to make. This is 918 kilohertz. Stones and Memory Motel. 